Welcome, I'm from Xiaomi show me Mi 10T Lite and today I will show you how to enable and set up the do not disturb mode. And to get started, simply pull down the notification panel and look for the do not disturb mode toggle, which for me it looks like it's on the second page, this moon icon with the D and D. That's the do not disturb mode. Now once you find it, you can either tap on it and it will enable whatever default settings are set to it. So as you can see, just to do not disturb mode and right now it's enabled, but you can also hold the toggle and this will take you to the settings. Now, if you didn't actually turn it on uh, like I did, you'll have it set to regular when you enter settings. And to actually change settings, you do need to tap on it to enable it. Kind of weird, but what can you do? And once it's enabled, you will have a list of the options that you can change. So allow incoming calls and you can allow them from anyone, contacts, favorites, or no one. Now, right now it's set to none, um, which is why I'm keeping it because there's another option right here. And if you enable this and someone calls you twice within a 15 minute period, as it is stated here, the second time around, they will be actually able to reach you completely bypassing the first allow incoming calls option. So by default, it should block everybody, but with this one being enabled, if someone is persistent enough to call you twice within a 15 minute period, they will be able to reach you. So a good option in terms of emergencies. And then moving uh, down, we have restrict floating notifications. So just the visual uh, notifications, if you want them, uh, then disable this. And if you don't want it, then keep it on like it is right now. And then we also have at the very bottom, the schedule turn on time. And this will allow you to set a schedule. So the do not disturb mode would turn on and off automatically based on the day of the week and the time. And there is one set by default, which looks to be every day, uh, nighttime schedule, but you can change this one or also tap on the plus to add your own. And as you can see at the top, we have name, so you can change it if you want to, if you don't, you don't actually need to bother with it. Then days of the week, uh, every day, weeknights, uh, weekend, and custom. Custom will be the one that gives you the most amount of control over it, so you can disable individual days of the week and from there confirm it and then set start and end time and it will turn on and off based on that time and outside of that you can still toggle it on and off from here so that is how you would enable and set up the do not disturb mode and if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching